Hey guys, this is the real spot 9001, and welcome back to Let's Play Maximo Goes to Glory, part um, five. This is, I believe. So, let's go. Uh, last time we beat the uh, graveyard area, and we're on to the swamp area. I believe the path here is a bit less linear. And it's uh, these look familiar. So yeah. New area, new gimmicks. The coffins are now these things. It doesn't change much, but you can't actually break these ones. Which can be a real pain. And, uh, uh, yeah. I'm actually playing with my uh, PS3 controller with a cord attached to it because it is incredibly low charge. And that's why I'm running very quickly doing so. So I'm going to unplug it eventually, but until then. Uh, we playing like this. Never forget that you have minus a shield. That's a good ability right there. Good for the stingy adventurer. Hey, there's the armor I lost during the, the boss fight. I epically failed there. Uh, this enemy. Stab him and he shakes off piranhas at you. Square attacks are not recommended. So, yeah. Ooh, there's a diamond behind there. Oh, god damn it. Did I seriously just stick my sword into the tree? Yeah, I forget that's a thing in this game. If you attack a tree or something like that, your sword gets stuck in it. Can I dive into it? No? Okay. Did that just. No, that didn't reduce my reality. Never mind. They look shield charge. Now these are walls of spiky things. You chop them a bit, and then they go down. And then they come back up, because of course, you could never get rid of an enemy like this infinitely. I believe this way leads to bonus stuff. Believe what you will. Nope, nothing important. Just a uh, statue. Also, now I'm onto the uh, swamp area. I can actually find some treasure, but I can't believe that still hit me. Did that really do half my bar of health and damage? Or was I hit before? I can't tell. Oh no, wait, I got hit by a zombie before. Never mind. There was some delay right there. Bang. Yeah, the reason I said bang is so I can sync up the audio. You'll see me do stuff like that after I just play about the way. Most of the time. Uh, I believe there was a chest around here somewhere. I can't remember where though. Was it here? Oh no, it was in the water right here. I remember now. I don't remember what was in it, but I remember it being good. And I have uh, enough keys, I think. Yeah, I have two. Hmm. That's good enough. I also have nine lives, so now I'm a cat. Yeah. Uh, this is the other weapon enchantment. Well, one of the others. This is the, uh, what I like to call the lightsaber. It's incredibly strong. Example, this is a square attack. There, that killed him with a square attack. You know, the weaker of the two versions of attacks. I'm trying to get up here, but, you know, Maximo's acrobatic skills are not the best in the world. Oh, that's armor up there. I can't crack that. There we go. All nice and sound. I'm going to chop you up. And he's going to drop a key. Uh, come on, come over here. Didn't even move. Hmm. How lazy of him, not even bothering. So, yeah, I've actually got a cold now. But, you know, it's not going to stop me from recording. It's hardly noticeable, it's just a sniffle, basically. But it's okay. I mean, my health is uh, not that much of a situation here. Also, there's some nice. Uh, Thing here. 
Plasma. I, I really need that ability that gets you a uh, Washman Forward. It lets you see and find chests easier. Also, you can get up here because there's a stuff up here. I will be trying to grab every key I see because you can run out of keys. And that generally doesn't put you in a good spot. Extra life, I'll take that. Now we know that the game isn't made by Irem. You got that joke, didn't you? Did you smirk a bit? But you didn't because my comedy is horrible. Blue skeleton, get out of here. Oh, by the way, I forgot to mention this. There's a duck in this game. By holding down L2, you can duck. So you can do a low chop. Uh, the reason for this, you'll see later on. Yes, they actually uh, implemented. But it doesn't matter. How did that plant come out of uh, the solid stone? Solid stone, not solid snake. Yeah, that was me doing a terrible impression of Vinny doing a terrible impression of Snake. There's a potion here. Free potion. I just got stuck behind this wall for some reason. As you can see, the camera jiggling for a bit. Is there anything else here? Because this is a short level. Yeah, I'm actually just trying to drag this out. I might as well spend time here if the episode is going to be short. The last episode, I think was my shortest episode ever of anything. Oh yeah, there's that power up over there. Oh, I was talking about this one before. Notice how that's a power up that doesn't look like any others. It's because it's a special power and I'll be keeping this. This is the Mask of Sorrow. This is makes your invincibility count as the uh, like the stars in Mario. Yeah, you whatever you touch basically dies. It can't be used against bosses though. So I'm going to replace that stupid stab move. Which I technically should have done earlier, but hey. I wasn't really paying attention. And I, you know, I just came into here. I did write a note saying, remember, switch off stupid stabby move. There's some armor in there I could pay a key to get. And that would set me to the invincibility death zone. But I won't do it. And I'll tell you why, because I'm pretty sure there's some armor over here. Cheap. Uh, is it worth the risk to get that armor over there that I think is there? The answer is no, because I don't want to die. I know when to cut my losses. Hey, there's some armor here I can buy for 100 coins. 100 coins or a key. Uh, screw it. I want to show off this ability, so I might as well uh, just uh, pay a key and show it off. Even though you won't be able to see it very well because of... Uh, this stupid camera angle. Now I am Mr. Skeletal. Now whatever I touch dies, basically. These crocodiles, you're dead. Oh, that was a great power. I'm gonna try and rush to the end, rush to the end, Maximo. Kill the crocodiles. Nah, that didn't last me that long. Shield charge. Ugh. God damn it. So, this ability I just got. Your sword blade it has been magically increased, giving you longer reach. It's a base, but it's a good one. I'm gonna get rid of the second strike in case I die, which is probably going to happen next level. I remember there being something in this room as well. What's in here? Hmm. I can't see because the camera won't turn. I believe there are some more armor in here. I'm gonna spend a key. I probably shouldn't, but I will anyway. Nope, there's a lot of money. Just loads of money. I need more keys. I just got the Doom Strike again. Hey, there's a key. Nice. Ask and ye shall receive. 
Robots don't say ye. 69 level mastery. Oh, lolo, lolo, lol. It's funny because it's a sex thing. And this is the magic tree. Uh, is there a first person button? Yeah. Tree. And that's the end of a level. Whatever number it was. Yeah, I remember this one because, of course, there has to be something over here. Save points there. I believe there was like something under a tree branch or something, according to my memory. That was hard to get, but it was like a something good. Maybe it was just money. Don't you have any respect for the not dead? There we go, there's the money. Just loads of money. I already made that joke this episode. Damn bones. Well, it looks like someone killed Dem Engineers, and now he's just bones. So, I'll see you guys in the next episode of Maximo Ghost and Glory Adventure Game, whatever. So, this has been the real Spartan 9001, but you knew that already. Uh, I, I did not actually intend to rip off a... What's his name? Josh Jepson there. But whatever. You know who I am. So, I'll uh, see you guys in the next episode. Bye.